What's going on guys, it's Vray20 here, and welcome back to the F1 Sauber Career Mode. So, uh, for the first time in our career, we are the points leader. So that was pretty darn cool. Only six points over boat tasks, eight points uh, to Ricardo. It's pretty pretty close so far. Uh, Hamilton only 14 back, uh, Perez 18 back, and the, uh, of course Vettel still has to get going. He's sitting back clear to seventh. Kimmy's in ninth, uh, the defending champion, so... Um, yeah, Team A in the 11th there. He's picked up some points, two whole points after last race, so uh, not too bad for us. So every race so far, we've been on the podium, second, second, and third. Third was kind of a stretch there in Bahrain uh, since Vettel blew up with like two or three to go uh, and then allowed us. We were running fourth, got us uh, up to third and finished on the podium there. So uh, and the Bahrain's not a very good track for me like I established uh, last race, but uh, we're pretty good in Russia. So looking forward to it. Hopefully we can get the car dialed in a little bit more than what we did last race and hopefully we can make it four podiums in a row. With that then, let's run through the grid order. Alrighty, so here in Sochi, we're rolling off P9. So not bad. Apparently, I was supposed to qualify even higher than that. I'm not sure what Sauber wants from me. I, uh, I'm a pretty bad qualifier. They should know that by now. But P9's not really bad at all. Uh, we'll definitely hopefully get some stuff off the start here. But uh, uh, honestly, it took me a lot of practice to get the car dialed in. I'm still not 100% sure what we got and if it's going to be good enough. But uh, I don't think we've got winning speed, but... I'm sure we can find our way to, to get another podium. Let's head down to the track. Oh, man. What the hell is that? It went three wide, just sandwiched. We'll go get him, Ricardo. I'll follow you through. Oh man, what a shakeup! Whoa! Oh, oh, we're we're a couple cars wide. Man, up to P6. Not bad. Oh, let me get a couple more while I'm at it. Excuse me. Okay. Guess I'll look kind of lock it up. The hell's the leader? I guess the boat has. All right. I don't know if my setup's gonna be good, but it's feeling pretty good. It's cutting pretty good. That's what I couldn't achieve last week. Oh man, we got a nice little run here. Oh, got it. Woo! Gotta lock him up a little bit, but we got it. Come here, Ocon. We got this thing pretty fast. I can't remember. I think I put a little. I took a little extra downforce out of it. For the most part. Yeah. So we got. I mean, I feel like we get, might have a little extra straightaway speed, but yeah, this thing's feeling really good. I did put a good bit of time into making this setup. Oh yeah, we're faster. No con, man. This thing's feeling good. I don't know what it's gonna do in the long run, but yeah. I feel like I might have it set up a little bit uh, to wear the tires a little bit too, too much. I guess we'll find out here, here soon. Well, here we go. We're going to get Oak on the same spot. We got Kimmy. We're going to have to send it really fast. Sure, I'll go up here. Oh! Whoa, make it work! To P2! Get it! Oh, shit! Hell yeah. That was pretty clean. Damn, he about cut me off right the last second. That was almost death for both of us. Well, now the question is, can we track down boat test? Probably not. It looks like, uh, yeah, Lou's back there. Looks like he wants through, so... That sucks, too. Boat test is second in points. Ideally, we want to get... Oh, man. Lewis already got by. Ocon. Shit. Oh, yeah. Hamilton's up my butt. He's probably going to get me here. I mean, he's fast. He's got DRS. Mm, I'm going to take it up here. Go get him. Ooh. Kind of standing like a wuss. Whoa! I mean, I can't give you much more room in that there, champ. I mean, 
mean, I had my left sides clear up and over the curb. I do believe. I was still getting right reared. Ooh. Looks like I got enough gap on them this time. We're not gonna repeat. Went off at a one. That's clear over there by the time he hit me, I think. Got through there better than I did, though. He's I definitely believe he's quicker. It looks like Mercedes just hooked up this week. There's Botas in a league of zone up there. The good thing is me and Lewis Hamilton have dri uh, driven away from pretty much everybody behind us. They've got a big old groove all bottled up. Look at that. So, yeah, I don't know. I'm definitely better in some, some parts of the track, and Lewis is better in others. So... I don't know, I keep on learning here and getting a little bit quicker. And of course, he does have that DRS and that draft, so. Well, that's good. Boy, I could use some tires. I'll tell you that. His rears are starting to slip away. I'm not looking too bad yet, but oh god. Oh, here comes Lewis Hamilton. Gee, I'm pretty far over here. I didn't want to make sure I gave you enough room this time. There you go, still not enough. Look now, we're pulling away from Lewis Hamilton. Just a little bit. It's starting to get quicker and quicker. Oh yeah, by the way, we're supposed to pit this time, so. Hey, give me a couple more slides out of these tires real quick. Pit this time for the super sauce, and I want to say we're going to be going to the, all the way to the end here. So let's we'll see what he does. Oh yeah, yeah, he didn't, uh, didn't come in. He's trying to look at my rear view. I forgot where the line was. Okay, well, okay, so I was the first one to come in. We got it's like two guys behind me, so. I definitely wanted to pit before Lewis Hamilton. I might be able to gain a little bit on him. Release, release. Get it. That's textbook right there. Yeah, right, let's get it. Up to speed now. Let's get some heat into those tires. Alright, so yeah, we should be good to the end, I believe. I think. Honestly, I didn't really look at the strategy before. So. Oh hell, who's this? It's alright. Dick Sane's all up. <laughs> I didn't realize anybody was out there. I wouldn't really pay attention. Story of my life. All right, well. Oh, man. These new tires. Oh. I don't like new tires, man. My turn is so good. Again, I was figuring out new and better ways to get the thing to turn in. Just better lines, better timing with the turn in. So, we'll see if we can do this run, but these couple laps, this at least lap while we have tires for Lewis Hamilton is going to be big. Let's see uh, if we can get going fast and hopefully come out in front of him when he pits, but I don't know, so far over the career mode, we haven't been fast enough on our own. Our in front is All right, well, let's see where we cycle. I don't think Lewis Hamilton came in. If he did, he'd get out very quick. Has just come in for a stop. Got some pit stops. Oh, fastest lap. How you doing? We needed that. Oh yeah. Oh, we cycled way out in front of Hamilton. Oh, whoo, okay. And boat tass. Already out there. We definitely weren't gonna cycle in front of him or anywhere close to him. I mean, he's. He's driving his own race. Uh, it's not even nobody's even close to Botas. But I don't know what happened to Hamilton, but he's not even third. So I will take it. Oh, that sucks. Master Vettel with the fastest lap, and he is behind me. Oh, rip, Lou Samson. Well, at least we're not going to see any of him. Uh, that sucks. I don't know, the only guy we have to worry about 
That's the bastard battle. And he's closing. Mm. My fast lap by a tenth of a second. And, uh, not sure if it'll gain on me there. I want to say he gained on me just a little bit, but. Oh, rip. Oh, man, it's starting to drop. He's catching me. I'm doing everything I possibly can. That's how this game is, man. They always, they always reel me in, right? The last, like, couple laps. It always pisses me off. Cause I always feel like I drive, drive the shit out of it and I get faster myself, but doesn't matter, man. They always gotta make it exciting. They always just reel me in. You've lost some time to the car behind. Thanks. I've been, I've been losing like a tenth here and there each, each damn lap. Trying to keep him away from that DRS zone, but that's not. I don't think it's gonna happen, man. All right, well, Vettel's caught me. He's in range. Ugh, I'm gonna play defense for the last couple laps. It must be nice to be Sebastian Vettel and be perfect. Jeez, just driving my fucking ass off, and slipping and sliding, just fucking wheeling it. And then there's Sebastian Vettel behind me, driving around, playing classical music, sipping on his macchiato, and just closing on me like it's nothing. Must be nice. If it wasn't for Botas, it'd be a great battle for the win. Yeah, late race. Some massive metal all up my ass. I'm not quite there. He hasn't quite approached my rear end. He's getting close. Oh boy. Something inside through there. It's kind of like our battle with uh, Lewis Hamilton earlier. Especially as the race went on. I didn't quite get to my back bumper. Or, these things even have back bumpers, I guess not. I tried to get to my back back tires. I think he's gonna get pretty close to DRS, but we're holding the run. Oh shit. I mean he just had to be so much quicker and close in the last couple laps. Where are you at now? Should have just stayed back there, two seconds behind. Save me the trouble. Mm. Oh, nailed that. Nailed that. Where you at, Vettel? Come on, buddy. Oh, hell. A little weeble wobbling. Let me stop, uh, stop talking shit here for a second. Let's <laughs> get there for a minute. I got plenty of fuel left in this thing. Two to go. Oh, yeah. Felt pretty confident. Car's still feeling pretty damn good. I put a lot of time into making this thing turn. We got all the way down to the 53% brake bias. I talked about it before. You usually don't see me down uh, it's that low, but the lower it is, the, you know. You know how bad it is turning wise, cutting wise. When I say cutting, I mean like getting off from the corner. I don't know, it's a combination of things. Like when I hop on the brakes, I want it to turn, right? There's a lot of, a lot of different things it can do in there. A lot of different feels you can get out of it, but be general with it. You know, when I get off in there, hit the brakes and turn. I want that thing to cut off there into the corner. But, uh, yeah, a combination of that and a couple other things it did. This car's feeling pretty damn good. Alrighty, well. Final lap! Let's get it. There's a big opportunity gone right there for Vettel down the front. Probably don't overdrive it. We'll be okay. Yeah, I'm really happy with how this car ended up. This thing was pretty damn solid start to finish. Tire wear wasn't actually too bad. This is the longest run right here, and tower is not really bad at all, so I was afraid that I might have the cameras too high. 
I might chew up those tires, but the day, pretty solid. I still gotta finish this thing. The middle's chilling, but yeah, he hasn't attempted to make a make a pass you know, pretty much since he's been within a second of me, so yeah, so it all Yeah. The curves are the only tricky part for me, but He's not even gonna catch me through here. I don't have to burn up that extra fuel. Things feeling good on brakes. It's probably the best handling car I've had in quite a while. And randomly, every once in a while, you just kind of hit it. This is one of those races. Unfortunately, uh, Bahrain was not one of them. But uh, man, Botas with the win, led from the start. He's probably in victory circle already. Man, another podium, another second place finish. Yes, yes, we're on the podium. God bless America, man. I just want to win. Actually, you know what? I can care less, man. As long as I'm scoring points, the problem is Botas is second in points, so I, I can't lose to him. I, I could finish second in the entire season, and I'd be happy with it, but yeah, we got to beat Botas, man. We still got to be better. And it's hard to beat Mercedes, i tell you that. Brilliant stuff from Mercedes. Well, look at the finishing results of Botas. Yeah, I mean, <laughs> 18 seconds on the rest of the field there. Uh, nearly, nine, pretty much 19 seconds. So, I mean, that is, oh, man, I'm still kind of out of breath. Bo Botance was in a league of his own. Like, I mean, I'm sure Lewis Hamilton probably would have been up there if he didn't. Well, that depends. I don't think he would have got back by me, um, you know, with that whole pit stop cycle. But ninth to second, man, another really good run for us. We really picked it up, and we really ran We really ran well throughout the entire race there, so that's pretty damn cool. But um, yeah, Vettel fit to third uh, and never really, yeah, tried to get by us there at the end. So uh, Kimmy six to four. So look at the rest of it here, man. Marcus started 10th, ended up finishing 11th, fell off there. Uh, look at the rest of it here. So Lewis Hamilton and Julian Palmer, your DNFs. So uh, yeah, look at the rest of it there. Not a bad run for us, and I guess, um, yeah, we're gonna, <laughs> we're gonna lose the points lead. One dang point. Well, <laughs> at least we've made it close so far. Where are we going? Where are we going next? We're going to Spain and then Monaco. Yeah, yeah. Then our Monaco, uh, Montreal stretch. You can kind of sort of add Baku. I feel like I've, I've gotten pretty good there. But uh, oh man, just give me to Monaco. Give me to Montreal, man. Uh, Spain. We're, we're gonna have to get through that one. But uh, we got some good tracks coming up for us. Well, there you have it, guys. I hope y'all enjoyed the video. Make sure to leave a like on it if you did. It helps me out a ton. Well, that'll do it for me once again. Appreciate y'all as always. And I'll see you guys in the next video.